Yo, what's up, sports bettors? I got a little two-pick parlay, a little bankroll builder, pretty low odds, like plus 160, but two amazing picks that you should be betting, and one pick is for tomorrow. So we got 15 MLB games tomorrow, and I say this all the time, but as a sharp better, you literally never know when the value is going to occur, right? Where the value is going to be. So the play I found for tomorrow, and I absolutely love this play, is the Blue Jays plus one and a half run line against the White Sox, right? So why do we like this? I mean, this play is as clear as it gets. We're getting this at minus 250 on Fliff. That's where they opened odds. And you can see all the other sports books in the market. I mean, we have one, two, three, four other data points. Four other books have posted odds for tomorrow. I say this all the time. Sometimes the best betting opportunities on the odds jam, positive expected value, positive EV tool, they occur at random times, right? You never know when the best bets are going to occur. We're getting minus 250 on Fliff. FanDuel's almost 100 cents worse. They have this at minus 340. Caesars is right next door. They have this minus 339. Pinnacle has this minus 312. So, I mean, we have a bunch of videos about how to, you know, back out the profit margin of your bet, your recommended bet size, and manage your bankroll. We have a ton of strategy videos, but just as a rational sports better. I mean, you're literally getting minus 250, and you have one, two, three, four other data points pricing this around like minus 330 odds. So I say this all the time, but like you should consider every sports book in the market as an independent data point. All these books have their own models, they all set lines independently. So the way to beat the books is you let Odds Jam, you know, scan these tens of thousands of lines on sports books. That's all Odds Jam is doing, right? It's scanning all of these lines on prize picks, DraftKings, all these different sports books and pointing out value. And clearly, clearly, getting minus 250 is crazy value here. So that's the first pick that I went with in my parlay. So here you can see my two pick parlay. It's on Fliff. So Fliff is an 18 plus sports book, kind of new platform. I've been finding a ton of value on it. You can make a lot of money on Fliff. So two pick parlay, one MLB bet for tomorrow. And then we also have an NBA player prop for tonight, just following the value, both plays from the positive EV tool. Let's make some money.